canonization by John Donne. For God's sake, hold your tongue and let me love, or chide my palsy or my gout, my five grey hairs or ruined fortune flout, with wealth your state, your mind with arts improve. Take you a course, get you a place, observe his honour or his grace, or the king's real, or his stampid face. Contemplate what you will, approve, so you will let me love. Alas, alas, what's injured by my love? What merchant ships have my sighs drowned? Who says my tears have overflowed his ground? When did my colds a forward spring remove? When did the heats which my veins fill add one more thing to the plaguey bill? Soldiers find wars and lawyers find out still litigious men which quarrels move. Though she and I do love, call us what you will. We are made such by love. Call her one, me, another fly. We're tapers too, and at our own cost die. In we, in us, find the eagle and the dove. The phoenix riddle hath more wit by us. We two being one are it. So to one neutral thing both sexes fit. We die and rise the same, and prove mysterious by this. We can die by it if not live by love, and if unfit for tombs and hearse our legend be, it will be fit for verse, and if no piece of chronicle we prove, we'll build in sonnets pretty rooms, as well a well-wrought urn becomes the greatest ashes as half an acre tombs, and by these hymns all should approve us canonised in love. And thus invokers, you whom reverend love made one another's hermitage, you to whom love was peace that now is rage, who did the whole world's soul contract and drove into the glasses of your eyes, so made such mirrors and such spies that they did all to you epitomize. Countries, towns, courts, beg from above a pattern of your love, 